Article 24, shall the town of Hampton vote to raise and appropriate the sum of $245,500 for the purpose of replacing the Eaton Park culvert and the associated arch pipe culvert crossing under Park Avenue to Kids Kingdom parking lot as the existing Eaton parking lot cul culvert is deteriorated and safety improvements into Kids Kingdom need to be made and for the replacement of the major existing 24 inch drainage culvert under Park Avenue with two culverts to provide adequate flow for the drainage received from the area of High Street, Toll Avenue, Academy Avenue, Tuckfield, Park Avenue, and Winnicott Road, as the current culverts are undersized and deteriorated, causing drainage obstructions and reduced flows, and cannot be constructed as a larger size culvert without interfering with an adjacent sewer main. The sum shall be used for the engineering, design, permitting, and construction of the culverts. This shall be a non-lapsing appropriation per RSA 37 colon 7 Roman 6 and shall not lapse until the culverts are installed or by March 1st, 2022, whichever is sooner. Majority vote required. Recommended by the Board of Select Selectmen 5 to 0. Recommended by the Municipal Budget Committee 8 to 0. Fiscal impact note provided by the Finance Department. The estimated 2019 tax impact on $245,500 is 7.3 cents per thousand dollars of valuation. Is there a motion to open discussion on Article 24? So moved. Is there anyone wishing to speak on Article 24? This article has come about uh, based on uh, recent flooding events that we've had, some investigation that we've done uh, this past year and in future years before. Uh, the culvert that needs to be replaced uh, that you're seeing on the screen now from uh, Eaton Park area is a 24-inch culvert that comes from basically the uh, parking area to the sidewalk and then goes across the street to a head wall. Uh, and out uh, into the swale on the other side of Park Avenue. That flow that is coming from uh, the Eaton Park uh, parking lot is also taking flow, uh, as the Warren article states, from uh, High Street, Winniconnet Road, all the way up by Town Hall. Uh, there is a lot of flow that gets into this pipe system, and then it's actually joined uh, with other pipes that come in on uh, the park side of the road. Uh, this project will increase the size of uh, the ability to get the runoff uh, to the outlet. It will also replace the structure that uh, joins all the flows together that is completely undersized and ultimately with the purpose to alleviate the flooding that goes on uh, and uh, create a connection that actually works um, under Park Avenue. That is part of the first uh, part of this Warren article. Down Park Avenue, um, a little bit further is also a very large arch culvert um, that goes from uh, the stream bed where King's Kingdom is, uh, comes under Park Avenue and again outlets to another stream area. Right now, the culvert that goes under um, <coughs> what you call the driveway into the King's Kingdom parking lot, uh, that needs to be redone. There needs to be some safety improvements uh, as you travel into that parking lot. And then furthermore, as the stream continues down uh, to the head wall and that arc uh, pipe culvert that's there, uh, that is all deteriorated. It is uh, corrugated metal uh, that is rusting out. And in some cases, we can't get through uh, with equipment to actually see how bad it is. Uh, so there's parts of this that have uh, completely deteriorated. The goal here is to get one contractor, uh, look at efficiency, looking at mobilization and demobilization once instead of breaking this up into two different projects. Get out there, make the replacement while we can, hopefully in the summer so it doesn't affect the school traffic, and then get in there and be able to uh, pave Park Avenue as it is on our roads and one of the next ones to be paved. And that's what I have. Is there further discussion on Article 24? Hello? Oh. Yeah. This is, this is not just smart budgeting, it's very smart planning. This is a very 
old, this is an old section of town, very heavily settled, and we're still contending with awful leaking pipes and pipes that aren't large enough uh, in, in these areas. So this was, was basically thought of as two separate projects, but it's very, very smart to put them together, and that whole area will benefit. That's a great area just for recreation and residents. Excellent job. Is there further discussion on Article 24, please? Ann Kaiser, 7 Palmer Street, and a member of the Mosquito Control Commission. So I would like to point out that there historically have been problems with mosquitoes at Eaton Park and at uh, the area, the playground areas around there. Hopefully this drainage will improve that situation so they won't be calling the mosquito control constantly asking for extra spraying down there. Also, Kids Kingdom cannot be constructed until the drainage has gone in because they dig a foot in there and they hit water. So you cannot add those uh, the playground equipment until this is done. Thank you. Is there further discussion on Article 24? Seeing none, 